So my name is Dushari and you're watching Sea Lord News. Japan's government is floating proposal that would ban fans from all the Olympic events as events scrambling to address public concern about the spread of coronavirus. Medical experts have said for weeks at least no spectators would be the least risky option. Organizers have already banned overseas spectators and set a cap on domestic spectators at 50 of capacity, up to 10,000 people. The Minichi citing sources within the government said discussion about the barring spectators were partly the result of political consideration after Prime Minister Yoshihide Suga ruling party failed to win a majority in an election for Tokyo's assembly on Sunday, partly due to the dissatisfaction over the government's virus measure. The issue of spectators is due to be cited a five-way talk including the Tokyo governor and the IOC president Thomas Batch who arrived in Japan that day. The Tokyo 2020 Organization Committee did not immediately respond to a request for comments. Asked about the issue of spectator at a press conference on Tuesday, top government spokesman Katsunobu Kato said the Prime Minister had said holding the games without spectators was a possibility. The government is likely to extend a state of quasi-emergency in Tokyo and three nearby prefectures beyond an old end date of July 11. Kyodo News reported the extension would likely last a month, meaning the curbs will be in place throughout the Olympic, which closed with the ceremony on August 8. Japan has not had the explosive COVID-19 outbreak elsewhere but has seen more than 800,000 cases and more than 14,800 deaths. A slow rollout has meant only a quarter of its population had had at least one COVID vaccination shot.